السلام عليكم ورحمة الله بسم الله الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله This is Muhannad with the last episode of Don't belittle the little Don't belittle your fellow Muslim brother and sister Today specifically I will be talking about not belittling even someone who is a sinner Someone who is disobeying Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Because Ibn Zayd the scholar used to say a beautiful statement He says لا يسخر من ستر الله عليه ذنوبه ممن كشفه الله فلعل إظهار ذنوبه في الدنيا خير له في الآخرة He said the one who has sins but who was covered by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala should not belittle and insult someone else who was exposed by Allah So if you are apparently a righteous person but you do have sins don't insult others whom Allah has exposed them فَلَعَلَّ إِظْهَارُ ذُنُوبِهِ فِي الدُّنْيَا Maybe Allah exposed them in the dunya so that they will repent to Allah and to purify them on the day of judgment. Don't belittle others even if it was in the form of nasiha and you think you are more religious than others. A man came to the Prophet وسلم, and he was alcoholic. He used to drink a lot and he was beaten, he was punished and that some Sahaba, Subhanallah, Sahaba, the companions are human beings. They said, قَبَّحُهُ اللَّهِ مَا أَكْثَرْ مَا يُؤْتَى بِهِ May Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala curse him because he's always coming back to that sin. So the Prophet Sallallahu said, لا تلعنو. Don't curse him. Don't insult him. Even if he's alcoholic. Because I know that he loves Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala and his messenger, but he has moments of weakness. And he said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the famous hadith, لا تكونوا عونا للشيطان على أخيكم. Don't help the shaytan over your brother. Dear brothers and sisters, at the end of this series, please help us stop cyberbullying. Help us stop this emotional, this belittling others, even sometimes under the name of Islam and in the name of giving nasiha to others. Don't mix up nasiha and advice that you give another person in secret and belittling them and insulting them and judging them. Maybe they are better than you in the eyes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Don't help the shaitan over your brother who's already struggling. Sometimes emotional injury might be more severe than physical physical injury. Maybe you can ask them for, for, for forgiveness. Maybe you can send them this video and you can tell them that this is your way of saying sorry. And again, of course, forgive others. Forgive others who may have insulted you or hurt you. And please don't belittle any fellow human being, they might be closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala than yourself. This was your brother, Muhammad Hakim. Don't mess up your akhirah by belittling some issues in the dunya. I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to make this series of benefit for me first and to all of you. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Donate now. Go to thedailyreminder.org slash donate.